see if you can handle the sex. Probably give us extra panic to tell. Sorry if I gave a random away. Yeah, you probably thinking I'm a psychic man. Oh, wait, you a fan of the mess. You poof, you see like an elephant sale. I heard from a friend of a friend. And that dick was a 10 out of 10. 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 On balance, I agree with her followers, who claim that she looks like Mr. Bean, and then transforms into Kendall Jenner. This is an industrial strength catfish. Maybe it's true that a man's face is his autobiography, and a woman's face is a work of fiction. It's genuinely interesting to me, how technology and TikTok in particular, have in many ways, encouraged and enhanced the practice of deception. The transformation, makes her legitimately look like an entirely different woman. It's drastic alterations like these, that will make a person seriously question the ethical practices of catfishing. That being said, when it comes to deceiving others, that's what the world calls love and romance. Alright, let's see what happens. Ugh. Oh my goodness. Ow. <laughs> like crazy! Oh my god, y'all. What is this? What is this? Lipstick. This is definitely a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. I suppose what we take from this is that if it looks like a lady is wearing a mask, she probably is. And that a lady is not what she thinks she is. Rather, she is what she hides. Well, fuck me running. You, you bitches better be glad that I don't wear makeup on a daily fucking basis because this is pure, unadulterated sexuality, and none of you would have a fighting fucking chance. Now I'm terrified.